Monitor. That's right, hot off the press is a brand new Arizona drought monitor. We've made some more dent in the drought right in here. We were able to scale back on some of the first levels of drought. So let me break it down by the numbers and maybe you could see a better grasp here of what we were able to do. So we're down to 86% of the state now in that first level. We have cut below a ha uh, half of the state now at moderate drought. 18% of the state in severe and still that 2% stain of extreme drought. We're working on it. All of that liquid gold locked up in that snow that is on the surface right now, it is melting and that is money. You can see we're all above average for all of our Arizona river basins here at the moment. And there is still time to get our hands on some rain and snow. In fact, this is what's next on my radar. I wanted to give you an early heads up at our next shot for showers. It's early next week, so whew, not gonna mess with the first weekend of spring training. The snow level right now, our initial stab is right around 7,000 feet. The higher up in elevation you go, we could pack in the powder some more. But at that level, around one to four inches is what we're thinking here for a total of snow. Meantime, the valley could get in on rain, especially on Tuesday, around a tenth of an inch or so is what I'm looking at at the moment. This is going to come with a blast of strong winds. They're going to be huffing and puffing in the high country, gusting in the 50s, and temperatures are going to tumble with this one. So if that's not your cue to take advantage of today and our wonderful weather this weekend, I don't know what is. I mean, today is practically perfect already. We have all the boxes checked here. Mild temps, light winds, so much sunshine. And our air quality is good right now. At worst, it'll reach moderate. So fair air quality, perfection. Forget